Well, how are you getting on? Sponge Murphy here with another update for Spooky Toberfest 2015. Uh, I've been getting a lot done today and yesterday on my Hell Pit Abomination. It's mostly done. Um, I think the last time I had the update on this, I had the skin finished, and that was pretty much it. Um, yeah, so I got nearly everything else finished. Like, well, obviously the base, but I'm. Um, there's just a lot of small details to do on it today. Um, once, just like the whole model is just skin. So once you kind of get that out of the way, you're just dealing with details after that. Um, what I got done was the, the stitching for the scars and the kind of the scarred markings of the scaven on them. Um, I got them done. And that was just, if I can find it, um, Kara's... Carolberg Crimson, that's it. It's kind of a red shade. I'm pretty sure it's still available now. I know it's not that old. And that was just a, done with a really thin base or a thin brush painted into them little gaps. And then, you know, if you needed to tidy up, um, I just went over the bits of the skin. So you can see I got a lot in, still looking like f fresh wounds, even. So I'm uh, happy with how they come out. You have plenty more along the other side. Um, I still have to do the stitches themselves, uh, paint in each individual one, they're still kind of a bit messy, but um, the rest of them are pretty alright, there's a big long one here on his back as well, so just a little bit of tidying up to do on that as well. Um, I got some warp stone bits, I only put the base colour on his arm there you can see. Um, it's a bit unfortunate, there's only a small little bit of warp stone on this guy. I'd like to see a little bit more. Um, the skull. Oh no! I'll do the back here first. Um, you know, it's just a base cut of. I think it's lead belch, or I can't remember what it is now. But it's the old uh, lead belch. Yeah, that's it. The lead belch with metal color on it with a brass color as well. I don't know if you can see it that well, but that's kind of wood color there. It's pretty. You might see a bit better from this side. And on the barrel as well. Nothing too special there. I still have little rats on top of it to paint up. Um, I got the eyes done on the scaven heads popping out of it. So they have the red little beady eyes as well. There you go. Um, and the skull, yeah. So I did a couple of thin layers of Ushabdi bone. Just to get the skull a really nice colour on it. I wanted it to be fairly solid, you know. And with the marking on it as well, I think it looks pretty decent. Um, and then with a little bit of blood for the blood god on the kind of the drooling bit here as well. So that kind of makes it look like it's in the uh, it's still you know on the hunt for flesh fresh blood. So what I was thinking was as well as the blood there, I'm gonna put it on this hand as well to make it look like it's in the middle of an attack. You know, get on the hand all bloody. It'll be a pretty nice effect on it. So yeah, so he's like pretty much 90% done. Just a bit of detail to do on the back here. Get the mice painted. Um, get the warp stone finished on the on the arms around there. Um, and apart from that, well, just to get this, let I do this with the base. The kind of stone piece he's standing on. You know, and get that, I have to wash that back wheel. Put a dark wash in it and highlight it up. Um, you know, there's just some small things I've left to do. And then the main thing is to do to get the base done because he's not, he is glued on the base, but it's just this hand here that's painted. He just kind of lifts up. So it's just to kind of hold him into place and everything. I didn't want to glue all the parts down. So um, I get the base done last. I'm still not sure what to do with it. It might just be a pretty basic looking base. Um, there isn't a lot of space. I don't think I can do too much on it. Because the only gaps in it is like there's a gap here and a gap there, but it's 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 full. It's a full base, you know. It's going to be hard to do anything on it, so it could just be pretty basic looking, but it'll fit it anyway. Like it'll be nice. So uh, yeah, that's it. Um, I like I haven't done it anything on it for a few days. That's why updates have been a bit scarce. But today and yesterday I got some of the details done, and. Um, so, and I wasn't sure if I was going to get him finished before October, but I'm pretty sure I will get him finished now. 
If I have another good night or two now, doing bits and pieces on him and get that based on, he will be done for definite. So um yeah, so that's it. Make sure to leave a comment below, let me know what you guys think. Um Yeah, I think that's it. I don't there's anything else I left out. No. So uh make sure to hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe if you haven't. And uh thanks for watching. See you guys next update.